In this lesson, we will study the first chapter of the first book of Aristotle's Nicomachean Ethics using the English translation made by Thomas Taylor. This translation is available at no cost on the Classical Liberal Arts Academy website. In chapter one, Aristotle explains that there are many different ends of human actions and that some ends are superior to others. This creates a hierarchy of ends and therefore a hierarchy of actions. Let's begin and read Aristotle's text. Every art and every method and in like manner every action and deliberate choice appear to aspire after a certain good. Hence, it is well said that the good is that which all things desire. Of ends, however, there appears to be a certain difference, for some of them are energies, but others of them besides these are certain works. But in those things in which there are certain ends besides the actions, in these the works are naturally adapted to be better than the energies. Since, however, there are many actions and arts and sciences, there will also be many ends. For the end of medicine is health, the end of the shipbuilding art is a ship. The end of the military art is victory. And the end of the economic art is wealth. But such arts as are of this kind, are arranged under one certain power, just as the bridal-making art is arranged under the equestrian art, and such other arts as pertain to equestrian instruments. Both the equestrian art, however, and every warlike action are arranged under the military art, and after the same manner other arts are arranged under other powers. But in all these, the ends of those arts which are architectonic or master arts are more eligible than all the ends of the arts which are subordinate to the master arts for the latter are pursued for the sake of the former. It makes, however, no difference whether the energies themselves are the ends of actions or something else besides these, in the same manner as in the above mentioned sciences. I hope that you enjoy this first lesson in classical ethics. If you have any questions about this lesson or would like more information, please visit classicalliberalarts.com. God bless.